I can't drink this because it's so hard. Okay, hi everybody, my name is Saya and welcome back to my channel. I hope you guys are spending a nice holiday season. Today is December 25th. No, it's December 26th already. The Christmas day actually passed without me celebrating it because Japanese people don't really celebrate Christmas because we are not Christian. But we pretend like we know Christmas by decorating the room with the little light bulbs, decorating the Christmas tree, having a cake. That's the only thing Japanese know about Christmas. So we're just enjoying having the atmosphere of greatness of the Christmas. We're, we're just, just wishing, wishing that, we that we have, have the, the tradition. tradition. Like three hours ago, I went to the store to buy something very Christmas. And I went to the store on the Christmas day to buy Christmas things. And I found nothing, literally nothing. Like the store was replacing the products with New Year products. If I was still in America, maybe I could still buy Christmas things because after the Christmas day, the Christmas products are sold with the cheap price and people can still buy them. But here, if the Christmas day passed, the event is completely over and people are shifting their thoughts on New Year. So a few hours ago, I was in the store. It was the night of December 25th and the employee were already replacing the project. I was like, okay. So I couldn't really buy Christmas things for this year. I couldn't do nothing Christmas this year, even though I love the idea of Christmas. I wish I could decorate this room with little light bulbs, little Christmas trees. I ended up with doing nothing. And I regret that, but I couldn't do that in the first place because I was so busy working all the time like since September I think it, it was September right I don't know since September I was working six days a week every week like I was working not literally non-stop because my boss asked me to so I only had one day off in a week every day my task is a physical work so I definitely need one whole day for resting my body. If I had two days off, I could, you know, rest my body for one day and on another day, I could, you know, make a video or go out to do something, but I didn't have this day. So my mind was always on thoughts of work. I was like, in the morning I get up and I'm thinking about work. I come back from work and I'm still thinking about work because I needed to look back at it to learn and to improve in the next day. I almost feel like I was in the army or something because I feel like I was watched for 24 hours, 7 days for those months. So yeah, there was nothing Christmas about that. <laughs> and finally, after months, I finally got two resting days in a week and I'm so glad. Yesterday, I rested my body and today I went out to buy something a uh, little Christmas that I can feel Christmas vibes and the only thing I could find in the store that's very Christmas was this candle not even Christmas tree was left in there on the Christmas day no light bulbs or whatsoever this is so disappointing Japan always let me down oh my god vanilla bean scented aroma candle I really love lighting the candles because they relax me. And since there were literally no Christmas products in the store, I bought not only this, but not two, not three, not four, not five, but six vanilla bean aroma candles. I was angry. Wait for it. I got more. Yeah, that's all I got. How many is this? One, two, three, four, five, six, seven. I got eight boxes of candles. I was mentally going insane. I was so disappointed. And um, I was angry. What is eight times eight? 64? I got 64 candles right here and I'm gonna use it every day. New Year is a bigger event here in Japan, so... Yeah, okay. I love Christmas though. I don't care about New Year because New Year is just passing the time. 
Christmas is a lot about having conversation with family, decorating a room, having a dreams, and you know, dreams coming true, gifting presents to you know people you like. So romantic and wonderful. I wish Japan celebrate Christmas more properly. But yeah, I understand that because people, you know, people here are not Christian. Okay, whatever. It's so hot. Why do I always forget? I literally can't drink hot drinks. I don't learn. Let's let the candle. I guess this is how you celebrate Christmas in Japan. I place it right here. By the way, I'm wearing this ugly Christmas pants, which I bought like three years ago in Walmart in Wisconsin and I'm keeping this because it's so warm and I like how this touches my skin This feels so comfortable even though this is kind of ugly but I love it And this also makes me feel like we're in the Christmas season Just a note So like I said, I was working non-stop Like I was working six days every week and I had no rest I only had one day for me to rest my body and I could do nothing else other than that other than resting my body so that's the reason I couldn't make any videos I have a lot of video ideas that I wanted to do but I couldn't because my boss forced me to work not forced technically I agreed with that not forced but I agreed to because I thought my boss wanted me to do and I had to because I was one of the few young people who can work physically a new person is coming in in next year like ahead of January next year so I'm so excited about it if this person joins us I don't need to work six days a week anymore I hope this plan will not change I would love to have two days off in a week because I want to make a video because I have so much ideas and I have so many things that I want to do other than buying eight boxes of candles that's ridiculous good vibes, good vibes only, only guys. guys a few months ago one of my audience texted me and said I seem like I only talk about negative things and I made them sad and I didn't realize of it because I thought I needed to express my real emotion that's what I intended to do on this channel I wanted to show you my journey before I started making videos I didn't even know who I really was at the moment I had never you know looked back at myself and how other people feel by what I did yeah, it's interesting to hear people say that I'm giving them the negative emotions I thought I was doing the right thing, you know, to express my real emotions To record real journey When these people told me that, I finally realized It's not only affecting me, but also the audience From next year, from 2021 I would like to um, make a video that gives you guys the good vibes I wanna enjoy my life I don't blame coronavirus I don't blame depression of 2020 um, 2020 affected everybody in a different way This COVID-19 things affected everybody in a different way and it's so crazy but the vaccine has been started to deliver um, not in this country though we are not sure when we are able to get shot everything is basically imported like when it's too late but good vibes only we still have hope my fingers are always crossing I have so many things I want to do in 2021 I want to travel internationally the first country I would go would be America right I need to go back to New York not just to see my boyfriend, but also to, you know, revisit, you know, my favorite places. That's my mental treatment, so. I want to go to more abandoned places in New York. And I also want to go to other countries as well. Like, I want to learn Russian language in Russia. I want to go to the dangerous places in the world. Because that's the person I am. That's the kind of things that I enjoy the most. In 2020, I gave up a lot of things. So in 2021, I don't want to push down my thoughts and give up things that I want to do. I want to do, you know, more. And congrats to Joe Biden. I'm so excited about how America will change by 
you know, being under the different president. I'm excited to see the changes that Joe Biden makes. I'm excited to see how that affects me personally. Because I'm a foreigner who wants to visit and possibly stay there. I gotta keep my eye on that. So I'm meeting the same people every day at work and I'm, it's becoming like my second home. People there are becoming one of my families. I don't hate that job. I just don't like that I don't have my personal time. I've been planning to, you know, move out of the country as I get the visa. I was looking like one or two years, but I'm working so hard. It's not because it's, you know, I want to improve my work performance that affects my salary, but also I love what I do in the place. I cannot say what I'm doing because of the place's work policy. Yeah, I'm giving 100% of my knowledge and energy into the work. Two days ago, my manager told me that he will possibly give me one of his job and I felt like I was like, you know, promoted and I was so happy about it. So the funny thing I've discovered about working in Japan is that people who get promoted, they are not judged by the job performance ability to do certain things, they often judge by their gender and age. So in often cases, we got bosses who have no ability to talk, communicate well, do not explain things explicit. And many people don't have ability to even lead people. Male gets promoted more than female. As you get older, the possibility of getting promoted will be higher that's the typical japanese organization system so that's the main reason i thought i was never gonna get promoted but when it comes to 2020 people here finally started to you know question about that system the top manager changed and he told me he was gonna let me do things normal people didn't do and i was so excited i don't exactly know what he will let me do but change is always exciting and you know i feel like i'm special like i said before good vibes only here even though i talk about this country but when things like that happens i feel hopeful at least smirnoff vodka so pretty you know what i'm gonna let as many candles as possible to lift the Christmas spirit. Are you guys seeing this candle? Oh no, don't be shy. I have no one to celebrate Christmas with, but I guess celebrated it with co workers at work. It was so romantic. 2020 was me only focusing on work. This is like I'm in a cult or something. But the good thing is I'm not. Oh my god, it's so cute. I look, I look cute. cute. So we made it to the end of the 2020. Like everybody else, 2020 was the worst year in my living time. I don't know about other years because I wasn't living in the time before 2020. In every single video I made, I was talking about having a freedom. I was, you know, telling people to do what you like to do. Then this year came and everything I told you was nothing. I'm the one of the few people who want to, you know, constantly go outside to explore. And then the country lockdown happened. Oh my god, I'm here in this country without leaving this country once and I'm not dead yet. That's great thing. <laughs> I don't know what kind of lesson that was. I don't even know that's useful lesson, but I made it. And you made it as well. I don't know what you are struggling the most because people experience differently and I don't know how exactly you were affected by this pandemic, but I think you were struggling so much this year as well. The first half of the year, I was, you know, watching the news all the time. I was following all the news about coronavirus and about the vaccines. But the other half was, I wasn't even looking at the news anymore. I don't want to even think about coronavirus anymore. I don't want to touch the topic. The one I'm obsessed right now is the game Among Us. I love, love, love watching people play that. And someday I want to play that for myself as well. It'll be so fun. That game is so entertaining for me right now. 
Oh my god. I don't exactly know when I'm going to be able to have two days off next time. But I think it's gonna be next month at least. I don't know. I'm hoping if this new person decided to cancel, I'll be so disappointing. But hey, it's 2021. There will be no disappointing events, right? Right? <laughs> oh my god. So... Yeah, that's my cue. I hope you guys are having a really very Merry Christmas and Happy New Year. I'm so sorry I couldn't upload many videos this year, but I will try to do more in the next year. Thank you guys for watching my video. I'm really looking forward to make another video soon. I hope your new year will be a great one. I'll see you in the next one. Bye! <laughs>